I'm happy to present our app based on the ITSM use case and show how IT support headaches can be eliminated. Before I dive into the topic, I would like to start with a short introduction. I'm Patrick, Partner Manager at Yasun, and I'm mainly responsible for the coordination with Atlassian Solution Partners, as well as supporting them and their customers in implementing our app. Yasun is a German company with around 25 employees, divided in business and development team, located in the beautiful city of Mannheim. Mannheim is our only office, meaning we do not outsource any services and all the development and support takes place there. We've been in delivering apps on the Atlas and Marketplace for over 10 years and the trust of more than 10,000 customers are um, proof enough that we are doing something right. And in addition, we are proud to have achieved the Atlas and Platinum Marketplace that is um, for years a testament to our commitment to delivering high quality solutions. And we integrate the software worlds of Microsoft 365 and Jira. This means that on one hand, we optimize Jira issues and support tickets with Microsoft features. And on the other, other hand, we extend Microsoft tools with Jira functionalities. I will show you exactly what this looks like in a live demo later in this presentation. Another important uh, information, we are a cloud first company, meaning that all of our new features are initially um, developed and released for Jira Cloud and made available for data center uh, with a small uh, time delay. Also very important is the topic of security. And in recent years, we have focused heavily on this to comply with industry standards such as SOC 2 and ISO 2701 to ensure the highest level of security and data protection for our apps. But enough about us, um, let's start with the topic. Firstly, it's important to identify the root causes of headaches in the support. One significant issue is that support agents manage their tickets in Jira service management, while many customers favor Microsoft Teams as their primary tool of work. And this discrepancy leads to communication interruptions as Jira service management only supports native communication via email and customers write in Teams, make a quick call and talk about the, um, the problem. This results in manual work because all the information has to be documented manually within the ticket. Consequently, a lot of time is wasted switching between tools, creating information silos and disrupting seamless processes. And Microsoft CEO Satya Nadella also sees these headaches. In his, op in his opinion, companies need to move away from monolithic software solutions and separate data silos. The goal must be to achieve a platform approach with modular applications and a unified data model. To fully unleash the potential of the various tools and realize the platform approach, it integrations are crucial for this. And looking at these numbers, it becomes even clearer that Microsoft 365 with its flagship Microsoft Teams is a solid foundation and here to stay. Over 1 million organizations are using Microsoft Teams as their default messaging platform, resulting in over 300 million active users, which is quite impressive. And these are the reasons why we decided to integrate all software worlds. Now, what is the receipt against headaches and how can Microsoft 365 and Jira service management be connected in a powerful way? This is where our app comes in with Microsoft 365 for Jira. We offer a deep integration between those two worlds and we believe our solution is one of the best ways to improve the customer experience and support processes. Let's take a look at the ticketing lifecycle. The starting point is always a request from the customer. The printer is not working, laptop pressures, as an example. With our app, we offer several options on the Microsoft side to do this. Customers are able to access the Jira service management service portal within Microsoft Teams or Outlook. There's the possibility to create a dedicated request channel in Teams. And agents can also turn individual chat messages or emails into support tickets. When the tickets deal with complex matters, coordination between support team and the customer is, of course, necessary. With our app, we optimize the communication within Jira. Agents can send emails, like the Microsoft Teams chat or channel conversation, and they can also schedule meetings directly from the ticket. Sometimes agents need support from the team because they don't know how to solve the problem. It's possible for agents to ask for advice via Microsoft Teams or a meeting. 
agents can automatically send approvals and close tickets via my, our Microsoft Teams bot. We also offer a backup feature to archive message histories uh, within tickets so that no information is lost. Now I would like to switch to a live demo and show you the highlighted functions of our app. Now you should see uh, the Microsoft Teams user interface. Let's say I'm a customer facing um, problems with my laptop. Instead of searching for the service desk portal in the browser, I can access the portal right on the top navigation level um, in Microsoft Teams. So we have made in creation uh, at this point because we think that's a very good place for a customer to, just, to, to discover the portal. The good thing is that um, all the request types or configuration in general are taken over from Jira. The setup of this function is very easy and straightforward. Let's say I need to get IT help, laptop, brushes. Also within our integration is the connection to Confluence. So in case you are using knowledge base articles to, yeah, get some information or provide information for the customers. There's also the connection based on the summary field. Customers get these articles. Need help. And laptop serial number. As you can see, uh, the ticket is created in just a few clicks. With the new release of um, Microsoft, all Microsoft Teams apps or integrations are accessible across the whole Microsoft 365 suite, meaning that this integration is also available in the new Outlook client. Also on the top navigation level, it doesn't matter where your customers are working right now. If it's Outlook or Microsoft Teams, they have this integration on both sides. There is a My Request tab. So as a customer, I get an overview of all tickets I have raised in the past, get an overview of the status of the ticket, can click on the ticket, get more information, and I can make status changes here. So in case the agent or support the team isn't responding so fast, I can escalate it. Or in case I have solved the problem by myself, I can also do this right here. So let's switch to the agent side. I have received a ticket. I will assign myself and add Miriam as an approver. As you can see, we extend the support ticket with Microsoft um, functionalities. I need to get more information from Miriam. And uh, instead of using the reply to customer um, function, I can start a chat with our app right away. Since Miriam is the creator of the ticket, she's already pre-selected. We also have a template feature where I can add some templates and I don't need to create every message from scratch. And so before I send out the chat, I have some smaller configuration possibilities. Here with this option, I can choose who should have access to the chat within the support ticket. In case sensitive data um, is shared, I can set this on private and only members of the chat can view uh, the history in Jira. But I can also share it with my whole team so that it's very transparent. And in case I'm absent due to illness, my colleagues can um, find all the necessary information and continue working on the ticket. There's also the possibility to add a bot to the chat with the customer so that updates or approvals, something like that, can post into the chat and isn't sent out via email. And with one click, the chat is created. As you can see here, I get an overview of the chat within the ticket. I don't need to jump to Microsoft Teams for chatting with Miriam in this case. This is how it looks in Miriam's Teams environment. I get a um, normal, regular Microsoft Teams chat uh, message and I can reply right away, reply Teams. The good thing uh, here is also that I have a new tab added and I get an overview of all the request details. And here I can uh, make some status changes if I want to. There you can see the reply from Miriam. So let's say I'm not sure how to solve the problem and I would like to ask the support team, my colleagues for advice. 
I can also do this. So especially for companies who have a dedicated Microsoft Teams channel uh, with all the support agents, I can easily post the message with all the information of the ticket into this channel and ask, ask for advice. And also this communication, because this is also related to the ticket, will be clearly linked to uh, the ticket. And when we go to Microsoft Teams in the channel, our bot is posting a card with all the important information of the ticket. This card is also customizable. So in case you want to display more information um, of the ticket or issue, you can do this in our configuration. And agents can uh, reply right away without leaving Microsoft Teams. As you can see here, all the um, communication related to the ticket is clearly documented. So let's say I know the issue, but I need to schedule a meeting to Miriam, maybe with a screen sharing to solve the issue. I can also do this with our integration. I click on Outlook meetings and with just a few clicks, the meeting is scheduled. I add Miriam as a participant. Based on the Outlook calendar data, our app suggests next possible time slots where all attendees of the meeting has time. So especially in case there are up to five to 10 attendees, it's quite annoying and time wasting to search for several calendar for the right meeting. And this is a little helper to make it much faster and more efficient. There's also the possibility to add a Microsoft Teams meeting link in case you want to make a screen sharing or the meeting more personal. And also here with just a few clicks, the meeting is scheduled. I got to mention when I started the first chat with Miriam, we also have a automation feature. So we provide an extended set of actions and triggers, which can be connected in the native Jira automation. For this, in this example, I have said, hey, every time chat with the customer is started, please make a status change and stop the SLA time to first response because it's a very important step within the Jira service management processes. The last step to solve the issue is to get approval from Miriam. Let's do this via a status change because I added the bot into the customer chat. The bot will automatically post a card with the approval. So Miriam can always stay in teams, make interactions within the ticketing lifecycle and can approve the ticket right away. After this, she will also get a CSET and can rate the support experience within this chat. I think that's it so far. I haven't shown you all of the features, but I think you have now a good overview about the functions. And in case you want to make a deeper dive, feel free to reach out to me after this event. Finally, I would like to highlight the benefits of our app. So with our integration and thanks to the power of chats, you are able to build a strong and personal connection between service agents and customers and increase customer satisfaction. Another advantage of our integration is that communication is much faster, especially um, compared to writing emails and ticket, tickets can be resolved more quickly as a result. Support agents no longer have to copy and paste information manually um, since chats are clearly documented in the support ticket. Thank you again for your attention. If you have any questions, I will be happy to answer them right away.